your certified most accurate four zone weather with meteorologist Jeanette Kaye. We do need the rain, but it unfortunately mm -hmm. seems to be coming at the worst time during the morning commute. And it's going to continue through at least 9, 10 o'clock mm. this morning. So folks hitting the roads later this morning will have to encounter those wet roads too. Uh, we're talking light rain areas of drizzle or mist. A cold front comes through the area tomorrow morning. That could produce a little bit of rain. However, not as much as what we're seeing this morning. More widespread rain is likely Friday through the weekend. Yes, this weekend looks like it's going to be a soggy one next week is drier and possibly colder we'll talk more about that coming up here's the radar showing you the rain there's an area of low pressure along the coast counterclockwise circulation around that is what's bringing this rain this far west the rain is hitting areas across the eastern zone and along the i-35 corridor we're seeing it here in san antonio and bear county again this is mostly light rain and then we're seeing a batch of uh, the rain over northern bear county on the north side of town and down along uh, loop 410 southwest side of town now picking up some of that light rain Rainfall. As we go through the day, that area of low pressure moves along the coast. Once it heads farther north, it takes the rain with it farther to the north and east. So we are going to see some drier weather here this afternoon, but it stays pretty cloudy. There goes the cold front that arrives tomorrow morning. Not much rain with it. It does get colder in wake of it. We'll have lows in the 40s Friday morning with highs just in the 50s Friday afternoon. And speaking of Friday, there will be rain, but most of it I do believe will be west of I. 35 an upper level disturbance approaching from the west is what's going to bring us the rain Friday, Saturday, including Sunday, later Sunday into Monday. It clears out from west to east. We're going to see sunshine here on Monday. Uh, cloudy today, though, wet until 9, 10 o'clock in the morning. At noon, we still could see a shower. And then this afternoon, the rain is farther east. Tomorrow morning, just a 10 to 20 percent rain chance. In the afternoon, mostly cloudy to cloudy and cool. Friday, we'll see a little bit of rain, but most of it will be west of I-35. Friday afternoon is when we could see the widely scattered showers, maybe a thunderstorm. Although I think there's a better chance for thunderstorms out outside of our viewing area farther north into Austin. This is how much rain we could pick up across the area over the next seven days, half an inch to an inch and a half plus in the blue. So that includes areas along and east of I-35 in the purple. That's about two inches of rain in the red and orange. That's three plus inches of rain, and we're seeing that closer to the coast and over towards Houston. The cold front that arrives on Thursday will bring in some colder air, but the Arctic blast will stay off towards the north. Temperatures will warm a bit Sunday and especially next Monday before or another front arrives here next Tuesday, and that is what's going to bring in some colder air for next week. Next week does look sunnier and drier, but colder. 10 day temperature trend, low 60s for highs tomorrow, 50s Friday and Saturday, 60s on Sunday, 70s Monday. Then we'll see another drop in temperatures for the rest of next week before it warms back up into the 70s. 40% of the area will see the light rain, drizzle, or mist this morning. This afternoon, mostly cloudy to cloudy with a high between 65 to as high as 67, which is actually near normal. In the eastern zone this morning, wet, but by this afternoon dry, partly uh, mostly cloudy to cloudy there with a high near 70. 10% rain chance tomorrow morning, 63, 50% rain chance Friday, 60% both Saturday and Sunday. And then next week, after it warms up into the 70s on Monday, it cools back down next Tuesday. Here's the extended forecast for the other three zones. We'll be right back after this short break. Stay with us.